Yo, flight boss bitch, you know, for sure. You're not listening to the mind of an Antares moon. Flight boss star changer, you're yeah, and I'm here to carry out God duties and motherfucking responsibilities. Y'all know I ain't been up in a minute because y'all know how I get when I got air going through my stomach and shit. So everything is like a shutdown. But um, that don't stop me and that don't stop no show. And, and the more I jump into the experience of not letting fleshly, fleshly matters affect my spiritual nature, which it already has done a little bit. It kind of prevent me from going through my emails. It prevents me from doing videos. It prevents me from standing upright. It prevents me from even getting on Instagram. It prevents me from doing a lot of things. And I'm working through whatever program I didn't sign to come here in this vessel. And just the better I work through it, you know, the more I can prepare my next self, my, my better self. You know, but as of right now, I just want to let that energetic force know that I don't give a fuck how strong you come at me. You cannot stop me. Now, right now I want to talk about the pilot man sequence. You know, everybody got everybody clinging on this Fibonacci sequence and things of that nature where, you know, time has been pushed three hours ahead. Now, we're three hours late, so what, I, what do I mean by that? Um, remember when I was talking about it's nine dimensions. It's nine dimensions. So, you got one through nine. They all come out of the zero. So when you're looking at one, one is, a, one is equivalent to four. Four is equivalent to seven. You see what I'm saying? So you got one, four, seven. That's an energetic force. You know, four is a more impactful one, um, which it creates four ones, can create a square. And then seven, you can cut it off and square off somewhere else and, and create another square. You see what I'm saying? Now, when we get to the even numbers, uh, not the even numbers, but when we get to the, the, the second order, we have two, five, and eight. So... 2, 5, and 8 creates um, an energetic force also. So, understand that. Now, then you have 3, 6, 9. So here's the pilot mass sequence. If you was to go ahead and take any kind of clock or watch or whatever, right? And make it exactly 3 hours early than the time it is now. Here's what you're going to get. You're going to be able to know the time by just looking at the first two numbers. So, if it's 12 o'clock, that means it's going to be 3 o'clock a.m. or p.m., right? But you think that's simple, right? But here's where the pilot man sequence come in. When it turns 1 o'clock, Add it up. Add three hours ahead. It's four o'clock. See what I'm saying? When you see two o'clock, you have no choice but to think, okay, in this reality, it's five o'clock. Then when you get to three o'clock, you have no choice but to look at it like it's six o'clock. Now, do you get what you get where I'm going with this? See, when it was 12 o'clock, it went to 3. But remember when I said 1 is equivalent to 4 and 7? When it was 1 o'clock, it was 4. See, when you make the clock 3 hours ahead, 1 o'clock is really 4 o'clock. 1 is equivalent to 4 and 7. Now, go to 4 o'clock. 5, 6, 7. You see what I'm saying? We're dealing with a time... Under a time, under a time. This is like clocks. And learning numbers and things of that nature helps you understand the clock a little better. The overall clock. And how much time is going on. You see what I'm saying? 
Like it don't matter how how you want to put it. Five o'clock. Five o'clock. What is that? Eight. Six, seven, eight. I just told you two, five, and eight is connected. One, four, and seven is connected. Two, five, and eight is connected. Three, six, nine is connected. Now when you take it out of looking at them as numbers to add on and start looking at them as energetic forces, you start to see certain things. And this is how you can see that our this reality time is off. But when people say the time is off and things of that nature, it's not necessarily the time is off. It's just the best way we can tell time in our reality because we're up under a time. So the better way we know how to count. This is, this is why Western astrology was made. This is why, you know what I'm saying, the time where people may call the wrong time. This is why it was made. It was made so we can calculate it the best way we can. Then once you get spiritually inclined enough, you know how to calculate it from a higher point of view. You see what I'm saying? So let's go back. One, four, and seven is connected. Two, five, and eight is connected. Three, six, nine is connected. Now, three, six, nine comes from the zero. Because you see what I'm saying? Now, it don't matter if you set the clock three hours ahead of the clock now, it don't matter what number you fall on of the hour. You're going to see a resemblance between. 1, 4, and 7, 2, 5, and 8, and 3, 6, 9. No matter what time of the day it is, you're going to be able to see those patterns. See what I'm saying? Like, look at it. If it's 7 o'clock, 8, 9, 10. Go back to 1. See what I'm saying? 1, 4, and 7 is connected. No matter how you put it. Two, four, I mean two, five, eight is connected. No matter how you put it. Three, six, nine is connected, no matter how you put it. Now, this is beyond math, but at the same time, this lets you understand that is that numbers is more than numbers to add with. Flight bus bitch. And I'm finna check my emails right now because I just I'm I'm, I can't even move around. I can't go nowhere, so I can't really do nothing right now. But do y'all NATO reading? So any anybody who want uh, who I haven't looked at for the past two days, when I was super down, um, I'm getting ready to go in your emails now. So if you wanted a NATO chart reading, uh, you finna get a message back right now and finna check on my messages because I ain't got shit else to do. And um, yeah, just keep keep me in y'all energies. Flight boss, bitch. Goddamn man.